Welcome back to Infigyan, my dear friends. Today in this video, we are having one very interesting Olympiad challenge from rational equations. Equation is 1 over x plus 2 whole power 6 plus 1 over x minus 2 whole power 6 equal to 8 times x square plus 4 whole cube over x square minus 4 whole power is 6. We have to find out all solutions possible for x. I will begin this video by writing domain. Straight away, denominator cannot be 0, denominator cannot be 0, denominator cannot be 0. So from first one, I can write x cannot be equal to negative 2. From second one, I can write x cannot be equal to plus 2. From RHS denominator, I can write x cannot be equal to plus and minus 2. So overall conclusion is, x cannot be equal to plus and minus 2. Now I will take LCM of the given equation. So let us take LCM. So I will write it is x minus 2 whole power 6 plus x plus 2 whole power 6 divided by x plus 2 whole power 6 times x minus 2 whole power 6 and RHS will be as it is 8 times x square plus 4 whole cube over x square minus 4 whole power 6. Now if I will take in the denominator power 6 common c it is x plus 2 whole power 6 plus x minus 2 whole power 6 divided by now I will write like this x plus 2 in bracket x minus 2 in bracket then I will put power 6 equal to 8 times x square plus 4 whole cube divided by x square minus 4 whole power 6. Now a plus b a minus b written in the LHS denominator. So I will write this value as x square minus 4. Now you can see right hand side is also x square minus 4 whole power 6. So we can cancel these two denominator. So it would be one left. So what is left? That is x plus 2 whole power is 6 plus x minus 2 whole power is 6 equal to 8 times x square plus 4 whole cube. Now I will write once x plus 2 whole power 6 plus x minus 2 whole power 6 equal to 8 times x square plus 4 whole cube. Now I will use one powerful exponent property which states that a power b whole power c. It is nothing but a power b times c. So we can write our equation as x plus 2 whole square and then we will consider whole cube plus x minus 2 whole square and then we will write cube 2 times 3 is 6 equal to 8 times x square plus 4 whole cube. Now I will use substitution this bracket curly bracket I will consider A and second curly bracket I will consider B. So left hand side it is A cube plus B cube. Let me write A cube plus B cube. What about right hand side? So let us add both A and B. So I will write let us calculate separately what is A plus B value. So A plus B value will be x plus 2 whole square plus x minus 2 whole square. Let's expand it. a plus b whole square formula I will use. So a square, so x square plus 2ab, so plus 4x plus b square, so 4. Similarly, a minus b whole square identity. x square minus 4x plus 4. Now we will cancel these two. So what is coming out? It is 2 times x square plus 4. And left hand side it is a plus b calculation. Now I will take cube of this equation. 
so a plus b whole cube will be 8 2 cube is 8 x square plus 4 whole cube and see what is written in rhs here it is same thing so what i will write now right hand side will be a plus b whole cube so problem is resolved now we have to solve this and remember our substitution is x plus 2 whole square is a and x minus 2 whole square is b so i will write here a cube plus b cube equal to a plus b whole cube and x plus 2 whole square is a this was our substitution and x minus 2 whole square is b let us solve this equation so i will use one algebraic identity in rhs a plus b whole cube so i will be writing a cube plus b cube plus 3ab in bracket a plus b okay now i will cancel a cube and b cube now what is left 3ab in bracket a plus b equal to 0 so from here i can conclude a dot b dot a plus b equal to 0 product of all three is 0 conclusion is either a equal to 0 or b equal to 0 or a plus b equal to 0 now let us put the value of a b so what is a plus b also we will write a plus b equal to it was 2 times x square plus 4 ok now i will put all the 3 values so a equal to 0 so i will write x plus 2 whole square this is our a equal to 0 so from here i can conclude x is equal to minus 2 with multiplicity 2 or minus 2 minus 2 you can also write and this solution is minus 2 so it is not accepted as per domain so we will reject this solution now come to b equal to 0 so i will write x minus 2 whole square equal to 0 from here we will write x is equal to 2 with multiplicity 2 and since it is from the non-domain list of the quotient equation so i will reject this one also it is not accepted so we will reject this now a plus b equal to 0 so i will write here 2 times x square plus 4 equal to 0 so x square equal to negative 4 a square is negative that means it is 4 times i square complex solution is about to come once you will take a square root both sides it will be plus minus 2i so only two solutions are there and both the solutions are complex valued the real solutions were rejected as they were not in the domain of the equation so what i will write now our solution will be plus 2 rejected minus 2 rejected only accepted complex solutions are plus minus 2i i hope you like this video thank you so much for watching friends do not forget to like share and subscribe bye bye till next video good luck and take care of yourself